I know they can't say Mzimba Sheka in uh, Denmark, but this was one of the goals that he scored this season. Mandla Masango with the overhead to find the back of the net to impress the fans at Randers FC and to really stamp the fact that 27 games, six goals, a great debut in European football. The ex-Kaiser Chiefs man joins me here in the studio. Mandla, grateful Masango. Grateful is the middle name, Angit. Yeah. Thank you. Why are we going to grateful? We are grateful for what you are doing in Denmark. No, thank you very much. Let's talk a little bit about maybe just before you left, because that's maybe where a lot of people want to hear the story. What happened at the end? I went to Denmark and I started playing in Denmark. That's a story for another day. No, but the one before Denmark, just before, just, 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 last day is Mzansi. <laughs> then, before then, because there was conversations, you were having a conversation, then it was no longer conversation. <laughs> That's a story for another day. <laughs> <laughs> I got for the weekend. <laughs> okay, why did you choose Denmark? Because there were lots of options. You could have gone uh, rumors sundowns, uh, Rennes in France, uh, Turkey. Why Denmark? Um, you know, the first thing on my mind was to get game time that was important for me. Mm. If I had to move over to Ren, maybe um, I wouldn't have go gotten enough game time. A France. Yeah, but now I started in Denmark where I, I got uh, to play a steering role in the team. Mm. And eventually now um, I'm ready to step up. We're staring, Vele. You know you talk about here a, sta a, staring, a staring role. You were voted. What happened there? There was a vote. The newspaper ran a vote uh, in Randers. What did they say? Um, I didn't even know that that's how it's done. Because here in South Africa, normally we have uh, awards end of the season. They, uh, the fans, they decide who they want uh, to be the player of the season. Mm. So there was a poll of votes, and uh, I won by far. So. I'm grateful for that. It shows that uh, I'm doing something good and I'm really thankful for the support back home, my family and the render supporters. You're your club's player of the season, first season, Unge Nanje, take over. <laughs> I, I had to, you know, but um, it wasn't easy because when I first came, the coach said, uh, you look small because those guys, they're physically big. Mm. But uh, as time went, it started giving me uh, the confidence that I needed from him. And then he said, uh, go, go out there and shine Mandala because he cannot say Mandala. <laughs> so he calls me Mandala, you know. So every time he says to me, Mandala, Mandala, <laughs> you know, so... <laughs> They cannot pronounce my name. <laughs> you were quoted as saying that football in Europe is like chess. What do you mean? Um, it's more tactical. Compared to that? Compared to here. And uh, I think their pace is very high. The tempo of the game is much higher. And one mistake, you get punished. You don't have time on the ball to do tricks, you know? It's uh, straightforward football. <laughs> I le is staying le. Me, me na, when it comes to me, the coach at first said, um, he asked me why are you show boating. I said that's my culture. That's how I play football. He said to me, okay, if you show boat going forward and beating defenders, then do it all the time. I said thank you. And then why answer? Then the even from season. first game in Dota, first game, first debut match, Osafagi chazi. A man of the match. <laughs> you know, when uh, the man above says it's time, it's time. Nobody can take that away from him. Now you've had this first taste of European football. And already, I, 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 Mandra needs to come home. We've got, places, <laughs> we've got places for him here. There's clubs with the budget that can bring you home. Would you consider it? Um, no. At all? No, no, I still want to stay in Europe um, and try and go to another level. There's levels in Europe. You <laughs> cannot just go straight to the Bundesliga and make it. You need to first go where you can establish yourself and, and learn the culture 
of uh, the European way because it's way, way different. No more things are normal. It's only a hundred dollars. Ten. Now I'm a suitcase. Not every month is a suitcase. Boy. Ah, uh, money isn't everything. You know, I was misquoted in newspapers that uh, I left because of money. Bofuna double. You know, the bad thing. Bofuna double the salary. Achieves. I'll write a book one day. Then I'll I'll tell my side of the story because there's two sides to every story. Uh. So my side of the story. Will be published one day. Sampoli, sample nyana. Just a sample nyana. We think, okay, mar. You wanna just so that we buy the book. The last days nyana. Was it tough? Was it hard to leave Kaiser Chiefs? Yeah, obviously it was. You know, it's not easy to leave a place where you're comfortable. But uh, in life, you mustn't settle for being comfortable. There's uh, always uh, a greater side on the other side. If you believe, though, only when you believe you can achieve anything. No one can stop you from achieving what you want to achieve. Mm. No one has uh, the keys to your success. You have the key to your own destiny. Mantla, what do you still want to achieve? I still want to win uh, trophies overseas and try and uh, play for one of the best teams. Anything is possible as long as I work hard and I pray every day and I have the support of my family. That's more than enough. And the people that believe in me and my abilities. So, yeah. Mandla Masango, thank you. You're one of our players uh, from the PSL doing great work in uh, Europe. And before I let you go, where is Guacafontaine? <laughs> no, oh, where is that? It's between uh, Pretoria and uh, Limpopo. Mpumalang. Yeah, it's in okay. Pumala. All right, now we You know. must come visit one day. We'll slaughter a coat for you. Nice, Abong, I'm coming. I'm going to Here I come.